We have a neutron detector that's based on optical detection of a nuclear reaction. A nuclear reaction takes place inside a chamber, and then the light from the nuclear reaction is converted by a TPB compound on this window and sent to uh, wavelength shifting fibers. Fibers are quite interesting. They convert light at one wavelength to light at another wavelength. So if I illuminate them by red, actually you see no action at all of that uh, wavelength conversion. The red light just scatters. Even uh, light from a green laser, once again, is just, is just scattered. But light from a violet, a 405 nanometer Blu-ray laser, is very efficiently converted to green, as you can see. The fact that red and green do not cause this conversion, but violet does, is called the Stokes effect, which is discussed in Einstein's famous paper of 1905, uh, which treats two other subjects as well, the photoelectric effect and the most beautiful thing in the world, which is the ionization of gases by ultraviolet radiation. So now I'm going to illuminate the aperture from the other side, and what you will see is that there's a conversion of this violet light to blue light, which is then effectively channeled into the fibers, and they conduct the radiation to uh, a photoelectric detector which gives us a sense of the strength of the signal.